So this is Alex. Alex recently went to the GP because he thought that he wasn't hearing well in his left ear. His GP performed an otoscope examination and saw no earwax or no foreign objects or inflammation in his ear. So this ruled out conductive hearing loss. But can he really be sure that it was conductive hearing loss and not sense and neural hearing loss that was causing his deafness? So Alex was referred by his GP to an audiologist. And the an audiologist is going to carry out a Ryan and Weber examination. Now these examinations are designed specifically to differentiate between conductive hearing loss and sense neural hearing loss. So the first test Alex would undergo would be the Ryan test. So the audiologist would put the tuning fork, this is 512 hertz, which is optimum for this test, vibrate it, and then ask Alex if he can hear louder here, or louder on the mastoid bone behind his ear. So can you hear louder here, or louder here? I can hear louder there. Louder there. So that shows that Alex can hear louder through air conduction, which means that all of the rest of the parts of the ear are vibrating and amplifying the sound as neural, normal. As you know, sense of neural hearing loss means there's a problem with the cochlear hairs or with the auditory neural pathway. So this will rule out at the moment that it will be conductive hearing loss, because if it was conductive hearing loss, then the sound vibrations would be louder in the bone conduction. So then the audiologist would perform the Weber test. So again, place on the knee, vibrate, and place in the middle of the forehead. So Alex, can you hear louder in one ear, or are they both equal? I can hear louder in my right ear, this one. Okay, thank you Alex. So that demonstrates that Alex has sense in your hearing loss in his left ear, because he can hear quieter in his left ear, so his right ear is carrying the vibrations as normal, there must be a problem with either his cochlear or his auditory pathway in his new left ear. So, thank you Alex, that's confirmed that you have left sense in your hearing loss.